created one of the first uh, mixing desks in, uh, in France, in my hometown, in my home country, and also uh, one of the first, uh, you know, portable turntable, you know, the, uh, uh, with a speaker on the, on the cover, and uh, just after the war. And uh, so I, I then I, I, I trained in a, to a, a classical background, and, and you know, rock, I had a rock band as well, and then I studied uh, electronic music and electroacoustic music in France and in Germany. And then I, I chose to, to uh, really uh, to do some electronic music, and uh, thinking at uh, quite early stage that it was really a new way of uh, approaching not only it was not a style of music only, but actually a new way of composing, producing, distributing music. So actually when uh, also the new media s went at the end of the, the cent last century, I, I, I felt immediately in phase with uh, new technology providing so many new uh, ways of uh, creating, producing and, and, uh, and, uh, and distributing, as I said, not only also music, but also visuals. I, I use, I really hesitated for quite a while between painting and music, and uh, so also I, um, I have been interested at a very early stage of uh, staging big outdoor concerts all over the world, uh, attending with rather large audience and uh, trying to create a new, a new style of performing and uh, way of performing music. I discovered this very simple idea that uh, music is not made is not made only of notes and uh, solfeggio and uh, harmonies, but made of sounds. And that way, and the, 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 this simple idea that uh, uh, between the noise and music, there is the, the hand of the artist, the hand of the musician. That really changed my life and really decided uh, to, uh, to go for, for um, electronic music and using new technology and the new, the, all, all the technology we, we, we are knowing now. My advice would be to follow your idea and your project, whatever, what, whatever. Uh, if, uh, even if uh, you have critics, you have, um, uh, you have um, doubts, I mean, just go for it. And uh, the main difference between, uh, between arts, creation, and, uh, and anything else is actually it's timeless. I mean, uh, a good piece of music, a good piece of literature, a good movie, is timeless. So, so it's not linked by the idea that uh, it will be, uh, uh, it, it would be uh, old fashioned after a week. So go for it and, and you are unique. And as a unique, as a unique uh, uh, human being, you are able to create unique things. I think that would say that uh, respect and protect the arts and creators' rights is uh, saving yourself, is saving your kids, is saving your identity wherever you are, an African, an American, uh, Chinese, and this is a priority for the for, for future generation. So, hi, my name is Jean-Michel Jarre, and uh, I think it's time now to respect and protect creators' rights and arts, because it's part of our DNA and the DNA of the future generations.